Guys, I'm Jeff the Homestead Dad, and it is four o'clock on Saturday afternoon. It is 89 degrees with a super high dew point, and it is miserable out. But we just got home from having a wonderful day. So we went fishing on Lake Erie for walleye. I took Joshua and Lucy and Jonah, and we went and uh, we went with some friends, and we went out of uh, Port Clinton. We came home with a mess of walleye fillets. Look at that. I don't know, probably seven, eight, nine, ten pounds. Good amount of walleye fillets. In fact, I'm going to go ahead and put these in the fridge. I'm going to have to repackage some of them because um, I'll probably freeze some of them. I don't know that we'll be able to eat all of these before we need to. This is a lot of, a lot of walleye. It doesn't look like a lot, but it's heavy. Um, so we got up. Oh, the lights are going to mess with the camera. Let's go back outside where it's super ridiculous hot. So, by the way, this barn is really nice and comfortable. It is not air conditioned in the slightest. Um, but it's super well insulated. And then you've got the cement slab on the ground. And I've got a dehumidifier in here. So it stays really cool most of the time. Let's go back outside where the camera's not going to be messed with. So we got up this morning at, uh, I got up at 3.20. I woke the kids up at 3.30. And we got on the road a little bit before, about quarter to four. It's a little under two hours down to Port Clinton. And we were on the water, I don't know, probably by 6.15, about 6.30. And we had, so we tried doing this last year. I don't know if you guys remember, but it was blowing like 40 miles an hour, like constant. And um, it was just too rough, so we didn't go out. So. This time the wind was not nearly as bad. We um, went out, there was some wind, there were three foot rollers when we got out in the big lake and uh, the boat was kind of rolling back and forth. <laughs> some people got car sick, I, or not car sick, seasick. I was actually worried about getting seasick. I've never gotten seasick before, um, but I haven't been out on a boat on a big lake in a while. So I was like, man, I hope I don't get seasick. I don't wanna, you know, have it be a bummer for the rest of the people and whatever. So we got down there and as we were going out, it started to feel a little bit queasy. Just picked a spot in the distance, looked at that for a while and uh, was fine. We stopped, so we probably ran on the boat for I don't know, 35, 40 minutes, uh, almost to the um, United States, Canada border. And cause that's where the walleye were. And when we stopped the boat, Jonah got sick and then Lucy got sick, and my buddy who was out there, he got sick as well. Um, but Joshua didn't get sick, and my buddy's son didn't get sick, and I didn't get sick. So we started fishing. Um, after Jonah and Addie puked, they got better, and um, they rallied a little bit. They laid around for a little bit, but they actually, you know, after about an hour, kind of rallied, and both of them caught some fish, and I got the down the system, so I was pretty much just trying to get lines out on the um, uh, boards. I can't think of it right now. I'll think of it in a second. Um, but we were running, uh, I think we ran five and then decided that since we didn't have as many fishermen, we'd run four board or four lines aside. Um, and it was a lot of fun. We had 16 keepers. We caught um, an eight pounder. Uh, my, my buddy's son uh, reeled in an 8.1 pound 29 inch walleye that's a good good walleye and we caught a couple probably five or six pounders as well we ended up with 45 pounds of fish uh, and i don't know how much the fillets weighed after i don't know what the conversion rate is you know, like pigs you get 40 percent back in meat i don't know what walleye is but it was a lot of fun um despite people getting sick we still had a lot of fun we got you know a decent amount of fish so um i'm gonna roll some video of that I didn't get much because like I said, I, I had planned on taking this, I did take this camera out. And as you'll see, I took some video of us running out. You can see Cedar Point, you can see all this other stuff. But then we started fishing and because some people were sick, it just, I, I didn't have time to do any more video. It was literally, you know, reeling a rod in and then I'd put another one out so the kids could reel it back in again. Um, it was a lot of fun for the kids, even uh, Jonah and Lucy who puked said they had fun and that they would do it again. So I think that's a, you know, a bonus. Everybody had fun except for my buddy who did not feel well the entire time, which is a bummer. Um, I thought about 
getting Dramamine, but I didn't. Should have really stopped and got Dramamine, Dramamine, whatever, however you pronounce it. But <sighs> walleye are a lot of fun. It's not creek fishing. It's not pond fishing. Uh, it's trolling for fish, but man, was it a lot of fun. And we were, for a couple times there, we had doubles. We were hitting fish really quick. It was a lot of fun. And, you know, just rods flying all over the place. Little ones, um, dink, you know, some some of the dinks didn't pull the rod off of the um, the boards. I really, it's going to drive me nuts that I can't think of the name of that. Um, they're boards that run out to the side of the boat, and then you run a line, you run your lines down it, and... I know what they are and I can't think of it for the life of me because I'm trying to think of it. But um, yeah, it was a lot of fun. So if you ever get a chance to go out on Lake Walleye or Lake Erie walleye fishing, I would highly suggest it. Enjoy the video, uh, what video I did take and what pictures I did take. Uh, sorry I didn't get more, uh, such is life. Talk to you guys in the next one.